gets the female monster, played by, of course, And good and hard to you all. I am Dr. Weiser of Rip, and when I don't perform illegal body modifications or surgical procedures, I'm usually here in my hideaway reviewing horror movies. So, today I review The Bride of Frankenstein, uh, directed by James Whale, starring Boris Karloff and Elsa Lancaster. We best so, yeah. Uh, this is a continuation sequel of uh, the 1931 Frankenstein movie, uh, with Boris Karloff reprising his role for a second time. This time the goal is to create a woman. Now of course, with Mary Shelley writing such a good book, and with the time it was made, um, they could only make a movie for so long, at least 70 minutes. So, of course, they sort of left quite a lot of chunks out to make a sequel to this movie. And I have to say, Boris Karloff, that old monster ever wanted just a companion, a female of his kind to look to you, that he could love. And of course, in this one, they get him. He becomes... Frankenstein's bra she he gets the female monster played by of course Elsa Lancaster now she now even watching the movie now I thought she was absolutely stunning I mean really she was beautiful even with that bride of Frankenstein look on her she had to look, she did not look as monstrous as Boris Karloff did. But still, I just, I liked it so much. And she was so beautiful in the movie. Ah, Frankenstein's monster and his bride. I count this as probably one of the Valentine, one of the, I count this as, as you know, one of the, horror movies you must watch on Valentine's Day because like I say it is beautiful and James Whale did a really good job on directing this movie also it had a few groundbreaking effects for which for its time was crazy you know very very good in stuff and also in the last season of this show I did review the first Frankenstein movie which is why I thought now we're in another season, it's a different year. Why not to review um, The Bride of Frankenstein? So, yeah, that, you know, The Bride of Frankenstein. It is a true classic to me. And I will always like the movies that, the, the, the early horror movies that Universal gave us, like Dracula and The Wolfman. Anyway. I, I don't know, I don't really have much more to say on this movie apart from, you know, check it out. I definitely recommend it to you because it is quite nice. So, yeah, uh, also, it's these movies that inspired me to create my creation, which you know as Frank N. Stein. Frankenstein, or I call him Frank N. And of course, yeah. That movie is the inspiration for my work. Anyway, my final thoughts and ratings. I like The Bride of Frankenstein. I recommend it to you. With that being said, I am going to give it uh, four brides waking up after being created and jolt to life out of five. So, be sure to like this video. And if you want to share, please share. Also, do not forget to subscribe to the official Random Horror YouTube channel. 
and I will be back tomorrow with another horror movie review. So till then, I like to bid you all all here to say goodbye, huh?